So I will give you four gummy bears, and then it clicks to the next channel. Welcome back to the Comic Store Podcast. <laughs> wait, 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 did we start on uh, You better have not really, have that on camera. We really have a really good show. No, today. we got to restart the uh, whole thing. Felicia's coming in soon, maybe, and uh, Bruce Gray is here. <clears throat> and uh, Jesse, Jesky Johnson, Juicy Jeffrey. This Johnson. isn't the podcast. Jeffrey is my it favorite. Is. No, restart it. Um, yeah. Restart it. Can you close it. that top door up there, please? Let's and, restart. And just you didn't run don't it actually off. restart. Let's just this. restart keep, keep it all. all. This, no, Tony. we're. I don't good. want to start with the Down syndrome stuff. Yeah, I didn't. Wow, that, now you're scared. That wasn't Am a, I the free speech warrior? That wasn't warrior a public all of a yes. joke. You're making me the you're that Trump joke. Supporter. That joke was just for you guys, and now, but I, I mean, I'll, I'll do it on the podcast. You know. You, uh, see, I won't do it, it secretly on the podcast, bro. That I, I, you didn't have my consent to record the Down syndrome joke. <laughs> Felicia, you said you were rubbing. I'm gonna ask you later. Is that what I said? And I haven't released it yet. It's still recording, right? Did you stop it? No, okay, Tony, okay. restart it, or I'm gonna fucking burn down uh, the comedy As always, uh, th shouts out to people who tip all the time. Mike yeah. Z and Big Bad Brad and Shannon, thank yeah. you for tipping. And Gino from Speedweed and everything like that. Uh, Felicia just ran down the hill. She needs a second outside. She rubbed down the hill. She, she yeah, rubbed she, it. She yeah, said she in the text that she was down the hill. rubbing. <laughs> and we had a great Man. laugh. We, we had a great <laughs> laugh, yeah. didn't we, yeah. Jesse? Um, we had a good week. I just want to get through some stuff. No, Brandon, um... No, no tip. Uh, no tips this week because the sheets are gone. But, uh, yeah, if you tipped, DM me on uh, whatever. That's I hope, how Luke I, I don't think, well, I don't think this is okay. the way to start the podcast. I think we should restart it and go for just straight from the top. Uh, <laughs> We're so scared now. I'm not scared. I just, I think you're I, terrified. I'm not terrified. You're terrified. terrified. You're, He's shaking. No, I think I'm that shaking. you're, Luke, you're, you're, I think that you're yeah. frazzled and that you need Felicia, to be hi. centered. Hey. Good to see you. Nice green hat. There's no going yeah. back, Ever. buddy. White hat. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Yeah. It's, you know that it's at, a nice checkerboard uh, with a nice hats. At Columbine yeah. High School, oh. all of hats the... And, women. and glasses. And glasses. Take your glasses well, off, please. What the fuck? I look, I look, I look different. <laughs> Come on. Okay. Whoa! Whoa. Oh, wow! Whoa. Whoa. Wait, 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 wait. dude. Hi. <laughs> Hot Luke. I am someone else. Yeah. Hot Luke. George Hot Luke, Clooney dude, in yeah. his prime walking? <laughs> yeah. Woo! George Clooney. <laughs> you look like the guy who didn't get the part of Spider-Man. George Clooney. Okay, I'm pretty, you know, that. my noodle's pretty waxed. I am a Damn. comedian, you know. Yeah. yeah. The shape of your head is like hat shape now. No, that's his hair. That's his oh, hat No, that trick. is his head. <laughs> no, that's his hat, hat bro. Is that his hat I like, I, well, I like seeing okay. his Oh, yes, and I have to text me. I have to text my hot ass wife that I'm okay. Uh, are you? Because <laughs> I, when he's, I get to a place, it's yeah. nice to let people know. He's required to check in every hour. Nice. Uh, no, every new location is nice to you know let yeah. people. I like to hear yeah, if she's girl. going from her yeah. friend's place to the cafe or whatever made it safe. I was like, good. I don't is know that what your girlfriend you? does? Your wife? Does she go from? Cafe to friend's house, back to cafe to friend's house. Usually, she'll go to like maybe get a coffee and then go to the friend's house and then come home. God, must be nice to have that schedule right. and be so hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's cool. I would yes. never let my yeah. wife go to her friend's house. Never. Yeah. Shout out my hot ass wife. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No friends, dude. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm your friend. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like you. Oh, you guys got the beer? Fuck, that's what I was gonna get. I'm telling you, this podcast is never starting or ending, and this I, is really good. I this think we, I think so far it's good. What time oh, is it? Just uh, run the every whole Wednesday thing back. we have a free show. No, we Wednesdays. Don't. <laughs> we uh, do and we don't. Fuck yeah. But God. we need your support. Yeah, tweet at Richie. <laughs> <laughs> Richie yeah. had a Twitter. Does he even have a Twitter? No, because the he yeah. would he would have been kicked oh off God. Twitter if he had a Twitter. Yeah. <laughs> he runs Trump's Twitter. Yeah, he was writing for Trump. <laughs> he was writing for Trump's. <laughs> He's crushing it. Oh my God. He is. He's really. He's still been on one. The the Richie saga continues. He yelled at me the other day, and then later came up to me while I was while I was seating, and from like to that door to here, how it's that ten feet. He was like, "Jesse's mad at me." <laughs> She's just mocking you. <laughs> like my mom used to when I was a little kid. Yeah, his son I was, was like, here. He yelled at me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I yes, like, I'm mad at I'm you. I'm a little bit mad at you. <laughs> <laughs> he kept doing it, so I was like, "All right, Fine. I love you, Richie." Richie we're okay. Yeah. His son was here the other night, and he told his son he that knew he was wrong. That's he, what it is. he told his son that I was the best employee of the comedy. Show. What? <laughs> <laughs> and wow. I, I don't think he meant it, but I think he knew that I'd be like, "Wow, that means that means a lot." Wow. <laughs> That's so no. a little, a little bit. moment, huh? I bet it felt good. No way, dude. Richie, I bet you Richie stood called. Up straight. I just I stood up straight and I <laughs> I put on my I changed my hat to a comedy store <laughs> cravat. I put on black shoes and I was like, "I love this company, Wait. baby, <laughs> company <laughs> man." Um, through and through. Yeah, dude. So uh, yeah, his son's cool. I don't know what to say. I think his son's cool. 
I feel like when I was 12, I'd be like, that cool. Make him president of the school. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. I, get I, the, like, my dad's Richie. Like, he know, like he yeah. says that. Oh, he tells the yeah. principal that, and they're like, oh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, uh. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Richie has a hookup with the principal. <laughs> oh, he does, yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, I'll give, hey, I can get you any class you want. <laughs> 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 Homework, we'll see. Right. Hey, he brings yeah. 10 kids into oh math God. class. Yeah. Like, they're with me. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're all in little kids' suits and yeah. shiny suits and rings and yeah. necklaces and shit. Oh studying math. Really loud in the back. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're Richie's kids. Uh, he, he comes in three quarters of the way through the class, kicks them back out. Yeah, they want to <laughs> audit the class. It's not a big deal. It's nothing. It's not a big deal. Why? The people sitting over here. <laughs> yeah, that's the teacher's desk. <laughs> I don't want to see the teacher in the room. Again. I don't want no, no kids. No teacher's assistant. <laughs> yeah. I don't want no kids giving an apple to the teacher either. <laughs> no TA. Yeah, no TA. And thus it's okay. T and A. Oh, oh. <laughs> shit. That is Richie. That's yeah. a little bit Richie. Yeah, um, it's Rich. Yeah. Yeah. So Richie's been on that. So that's our boss. Uh, yeah, the HR that's department. our boss. We just ripped. Uh, oh, I forgot we were recording this. <laughs> yeah, we gotta we gotta restart the yeah, whole thing. Yeah, shout out to the uh, God. I don't know, to uh, the dude who made the T-shirt for Richie. What does it say? Um, it says HR department. Um, it says T-bone on the back. Love is it. it. Is that a guy who listens to this podcast? Uh, yeah. Is that the same? It's the. It's the it is the you got. Mo- my, yeah. yeah the it's the you got Mo's guy. You got Mo's. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's badass. Um, he he. I want some like. He's really cemented himself in here. Real. The sticker real, guy. Yeah. Real crazy. Yeah. Like, cause now I'm like, where's my. I, I want merch. Well, <laughs> like, yeah, careful. Hey, I like oh, you no. right now, but be careful. Don't turn into a weirdo creep that, you oh. know, has like bodies in the bait. You know, he's like, already kind of right. No. Oh. Yeah. He's a comedy like fan. I think he probably yeah. does comedy. No, no. He's nice. But like he showed me a hole in his hand. So I was like, a hole in his hand. Yeah, he, like, like Jesus he was making something for Don, like a Don figure. And he, he said, he drew oh, a hole yeah. In. So it was like, so I was like oh, you're zany. Fit. It yeah. was like, oh, he's like the he's, guy he's from that movie, uh, You're zany. The Butterfly Effect. Remember where that guy puts his <laughs> hand on the thing? Yeah. Remember in the movie, The Butterfly Effect, where he puts his thing? I can't on say the thing? that I do remember. It's a good movie. That. I yeah. bet it's definitely you, a movie. Uh, whenever I was a kid, I would watch it a lot uh, because I'm pretty sure they show breasts. Whenever I was a kid, <laughs> I would watch <laughs> yeah. it a lot. I would watch The Butterfly yeah. Effect a lot because they showed breasts on it, I'm pretty oh sure. My God. And those yeah. breasts had great consequences. Yeah. Once you saw the titty, <laughs> it changed. I got to see this movie. Hold up. Everything has cause and effect. Your breasts. Have consequences. That's the crazy. Yeah, that's sure. what they Why should. Wouldn't they? That's what they should teach you guys in element in uh, not elementary school in middle school. Be like, just so you guys know. Fuck you. How do you know they don't teach us that already? You just what that your breasts have yeah, consequences. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They you they learn us. real early. How, what was your guys' sex ed like? Your breasts be have careful. consequences. <laughs> <laughs> Watch out. Be careful. I actually there, remember ever. my sex ed. It was in yeah. those portable classrooms, and the girls were in one, and, and the boys were in the other bungalow, and they mm-hmm. shared a wall. And ours was like. <gasps> Uh, uh, and then the boys' room was like, like laughing, dying laughing. That's really fun. <laughs> they were having a great time. That, well, when Richie did <laughs> this, the sex uh, awareness, what was it? Uh, the assault prevention thing, or like sexual harassment? Sexual training? harassment training. Uh, he was like, "You learn anything." <laughs> You guys learn anything? Me neither. Yeah. All right. The we literally, in front of the two. The oh funniest thing. God. One of the fun, Whenever we did oh the God. sexual harassment seminar, they did the whole thing. He brought it. So it was in the main room. He brought the entire staff into the original room and said, don't, no jokes allowed. Yeah. And he then literally, the he had a pre-meeting for that. It's literally all he said, no jokes allowed. He don't fuck around. Spotlight. Don't do this. And then <laughs> we went in there. We listened to the person for an hour. And then. Uh, he came on stage like, you guys learned nothing. I bet you nothing. I bet you didn't learn nothing. And then he literally opens a big binder and he goes, Christmas party December 17th. That was the first words out of his mouth. Like a classic headliner. He's like, nobody in here can tell jokes. I don't want to hear any cuss words. I don't want to, yeah. don't say the F Leave word. these people alone. <laughs> don't yeah. even talk about drugs. I'm going to cover that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Richie's, Richie's really a character boy. Man, yeah. dude, I saw a yeah. fucking comedian I haven't seen in years today, like an old open mic comedian that I haven't, like an open open mic freak, you know, mm-hmm. that I haven't seen in years at Costco today, and he had like two hellion children with him, and he was <laughs> like, he was oh, like, shit. the comedy store is really... Like, because Kelly had a Comedy Store shirt on, yeah, sure. and that you know drummed up conversation. It does. Yeah, the I always last do time, a second yeah. take when I get dressed. I'm like, maybe yeah. not. The yeah. last time, if I have a stop to make before, I'm not wearing. Yeah. yeah. The <laughs> last time I saw this guy was years ago at an open mic, and he's a he was a real wackadoo. And last time Zany. I saw him was years ago 
at an open mic, and he was wearing uh, shorts with, I believe, no underwear. And then he was wearing a big puffy jacket with nothing underneath it, like z- halfway zipped down. Ooh, ooh. And uh, he looks like a... Like He's a, a father now, you say? Of two, yes. at least. Uh, I think he was there for the samples, if I had to guess. Uh, but he looked me in my face, and he goes, hey, man... I'll see you later. I'm moving to New York. And I was like, okay. <laughs> Thank God. And then I was like, okay. And then I was like, what? why? And he, we were like shaking hands already. And he pulled me in close about this far from <laughs> oh his face. God. And then he goes, for Saturday Night Live. Whoa. And then was I didn't. Michael Longfellow? Yeah, it was Michael Longfellow. <laughs> and then I didn't see him again until literally today at Costco whenever I was, you know. <laughs> trying to get my shit together and then afterwards i was like do you know what dude i just fucking crushed it at costco go out i'm gonna stop by the fucking snack bar on the way outside and grab a hot dog and then i turn the corner and far in the distance i see this same guy and i was like maybe a hot dog's not in the cards today (laughs) and i fucking split dude he (laughs) saved my life that's the butterfly effect (laughs) yeah (laughs) Yeah. so uh, i saw that guy he said he's been signing up for potluck which is good yeah get him up i want to see what he does it is. It it's great. Yeah, it's a good thing. I think Hugo hosted Pollock. I thought he did. Him. I thought he was very funny, and I thought he made the classic first time mistake of putting up too many friends. I texted him constantly uh-huh. the entire night when he was putting people up, and I was like, "You're not gonna have time." I literally would just be like, "Hey, man, you're gonna run out of time." I literally would be like, "You have to stop. You're gonna run out of time." He got too. He got too excited. Yeah, and went for it. No, he didn't. He didn't run out of time because I was working the room, and I fucking you know, dude, you know me, I fucking. Yeah, you're you're pretty yeah. on the yeah. clock there. <laughs> yeah, I, we had a nice moment in the parking lot. It was me and and Hormos and I think Joe. I can't remember who else was there, but Hugo was really nervous, and he came up to me and was talking to me. Mm. And, um, I I gave him my flower pin. Yeah, yeah, yeah I saw really that. Nice. I yeah, saw yeah, that, yeah, I pinned it on him, and then I looked at Hormos wow. and I was like, "Now you give him something." <laughs> and then Hormos was like. What? Okay. Yeah. And he gave him the hat, and we could all tell Hugo like did not want the hat. <laughs> and then we were trying to get everybody to like give Hugo a totem to wear on stage. That's so funny. Um, that's but that's funny. that'll get him out of his head. That's a little really bit. nice. It was a fun moment. Yeah. He returned the hat immediately. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Luke, <laughs> nice. yes. I, I just realized right now, whenever you had uh, revealed the top of your head to us a few minutes ago, you, do you always wear a hat? Most of the time. For what reason? I I like it. Yeah, it's I wear a hat a lot too. I don't. It's a little you know. totem. I my hair just goes straight down. It doesn't do anything good. Yeah, and I have not a lot of outward stuff, but a hat like I it shows your taste and whatever. You know, yeah. it's like a shirt for your I head. See. Yeah, it's <laughs> yeah, a shirt for your head. Familiar. You you whenever you take your glasses off and your hat off, you kind of look like a Spider Man type guy. Jesus. Yeah, like not a guy who like it's not a guy who likes Spider Man. I'm little, saying like I don't know how to like, Spider Man before so the fight. Yeah, you look like Ooh. you could be a Spider Man. Like like, I don't. That's not it. That's that angle that's is terrible. not the angle. <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe it's yeah. good that you accessorize. Right, right, right. <laughs> I, yeah, and, He's you like I've been doing this hat a long time. Everybody knows you know you you look you look at yourself a lot in the mirror and you go ha I could. Use a hat. hat I like something. I like the glasses. They make me feel better. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like my. Yeah. Glasses. It's interesting. Rose colored glasses. Looking yeah. through yeah. the life like. I almost left the house without them today. That's Whoa. crazy. Because they're not prescription. They are, oh. but they're very small. Like I need them at night for driving. Mm-hmm. But otherwise, I don't need them, oh. and I can make it home. So, I can't. I can't. If you see me without my glasses, call the police. Yeah. Immediately, yeah. she's gonna kill somebody. Yeah. Last time you didn't have your glasses. Coke Coke bottle. Bottle. Yeah. I cannot be yeah. driving without my glasses. <laughs> like it's so bad. It's really bad. It's really bad. So nine eleven just passed. Stop. No. 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 Every year. Sorry. No, hormones no. had reminded me of it when she was talking about hormones. I was like, oh yeah. Because why? Because yeah. uh, he loves nine eleven. Yeah. It's his favorite. He told me this is his number one holiday. That's why he took off work or wasn't here. <laughs> Uh, do you guys think that I hate when people uh, push the rope to the side? I hate when my <laughs> fellow uh, you say something every time for everybody. You always like, hey, don't don't do that. Pull the stanchion. Don't over. pull the stanchion. Just like or lift you, the, you don't lift like if someone goes under the rope. You don't like if people go around the rope. Yeah, you right. don't like you go. You wait. And you get let through the rope. Oh I'm gonna, go I'm gonna get rope. big scissors and I'm gonna cut yes. the rope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That if as long as they're <laughs> oh, no, I, yes, I am. As long as they're big scissors. Yeah, as long yeah. as they're ceremonial <laughs> big scissors, that's cool. Yeah. I'm okay with that because that's official. Richie would be so big. But like, oh my God. Richie, like, like people, like I, like a manager, like Ryan will like just look like a person, just dressed kind of nice, you yeah, know. Right, right. Doesn't look like he works here or right, anything. Right, right. But we'll just push it aside, and then other customers see that, and they're like, oh, and then they just like kind of walk through it all the time, right. like. Yeah. 
oh, it's that easy. Right. Yeah. No, yeah. they say like, they, ah, something break. That's why, like, I also yell at people. I don't, I don't yell, but I, I kind of give you the stink eye if the club's open and you walk down the driveway. Oh, like, yeah. Don't show people uh, that they can yeah. do that. Right, right, right. Maybe right. we can act like the stanchion is really hot. Yeah. Do be like, so, ah! Ow, oh, yeah. ow! And, oh, then... and be careful, like a server at a restaurant, like hold it with a napkin. Just be yeah. Like, yeah. Look, really. Then people don't, won't go don't near Don't touch it. it. Yeah. I hate whenever you're at a restaurant and a server hands you a plate with their hand and is like, just be careful. It's, it's really, really it's hot. It's really hot. It's like, then, oh, you're serving. That's what I'm like, oh, you think I'm is, not. Yeah. Like, I always touch it because I'm like, yeah, I, not, touch it I don't I go, go, hey, check this out. Wait, wait, wait. How much did your mother serve you? Because, like, that's not like my mom. I said a restaurant. I know, but, like, that's something, like, people do who can handle food a lot. Like no, they're like my restaurants. Yeah, but like they the handle time. the plates all the time. You, like, can't what? What? I, you can't, can't handle it. I can't handle it. I do. <laughs> like, so what, what do you think? I'm not cooking at home. I know what a hot plate is. Is that, that some true? kind of sissy? Okay, maybe. That's what I, do. I look at him and say, "You think I'm some well, kind of sissy?" And then I go, okay. and I grab it. I think you have trust issues. Well, when they put it down, I'll I touch it and I go, "Yeah." Not that hot. Oh, I, wow. I, don't say, I say nothing out loud, oh, but wow. I do. I do a little bit of because I'm like, I wonder how hot it is. Does it affect how much you tip? Uh, be honest. You're like a yeah. dumb bitch. Truthfully, I yeah. swear to God. Usually I tip 30, but then I'll yeah. tip 29 It takes a lot to affect how <laughs> no, I tip I like somebody. I tip what, if, what if the server said, <laughs> uh, be <laughs> careful, it's an ice cold Jit plate. Is that what and then say? you grabbed it and it like gave you third degree. One of our more chaotic episodes. There's just like two it. conversations happening awesome. at the really same really exact time. This That's is exactly what I say, where there was no start point. This is good. This is like how I want it to be There was no start point and there needs to be a start point so then people we can know the energy. I started it. But I you just started it. You didn't say, hey, guys, in about a few minutes, or we're going to, all right, in five, I did like four, three, three. Times. we didn't get a Tony producer, five, four, yes, three. Yes, we did. That's a, you, to you, you. Personally, so, I love how much crosstalk is happening. This is great. There's so much crosstalk. And because there's but no, I do the energy was walk down the wrong. Driveway. I yeah. know you do. But I love walking yeah. down the driveway. I feel well, like we're also a lot guys, so we can do it. Yeah, we were, yeah, we, we uh, understand that. Walking down the driveway is a status person, symbol. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, and if you walk out of the driveway, that's fine. But don't walk yeah. into the driveway if you're just like, uh, like kind of coming in at like, se- like. Oh yeah, I don't if you're like that. an OR guy, what working else OR that night. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll climb the fucking I know, roof. I know. Yeah. I'll just walk, I'll climb up the side of the pool <laughs> wheel and I'll look at everyone on the patio as they're as one show's letting in, one show's letting out, and I'll say. Everybody can do this, okay. and then I'll climb up the thing, and then I'll right. jump. I'll Everyone, just, please wow. do. This. Yeah, yeah. He's helping them up. Yeah, yeah. See, what we need to do whenever people, new people, are training is we need to set up fucked up scenarios where we need to get somebody that they don't know that we know to come in and cause uh, chaos. A stir. Like Every the, shift yeah. I had has been pretty chaotic. Yeah. Really? Be, like, oh, I, don't, I didn't some, need to set up some parking lot uh, sh- shenanigans. Uh, recently. You got you parking lot shenanigans because I've been gone for a little bit. Oh yeah, you were gone. It was it was my first shift. I think, and it was there were racial components. It was, what? What like? Well, like you're like Jackie Robinson. No, no. Like you're the first black lot per, Like what? Like, oh I, no! What was so components. funny is I pictured Jackie Chan when you said that. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> I'm the, and that, and the that would be more components. accurate, actually. Yeah. Um, people the, like, just, no, you're like people, there's people lined up like screaming at you like segregation yeah. no. stuff. So I would. I try not I'm not. To I'm, use I'm names, not saying any names. I'm not saying. Save the name. Okay. Save the name. Listen. Save the date, bros. How about that? There was. It was a Sunday, so it was a night. You remember Faison? His he was supposed to take. Faison. Faison supposed to say. Thing and he canceled it. Yes, but a few like yeah, well, it, the world anyway. It. But he canceled it. The it market canceled. The market decided. Okay. <laughs> well, Capitalism but, and the free market yeah, prevailed. Right. Sure, but a couple like other headliners had come just to kind of check out his thing or whatever. So, but he he didn't come. So. It was kind of an empty lot. One of the bigger comics came, and they stopped, and they were having a conversation with another comic. I'm on the other side reading. He calls me over. He goes, You're literally reading a book, minding your own. I'm minding my own business across mm-hmm. the parking lot, by the way, because yeah. I'm scared of people. I don't want to talk to anybody. What are you reading? It is a book. A book. Something <laughs> yeah. with words yeah. in it. How to you, no, parking was... cars for dummies. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't, I didn't need that. See, this is, what, this is really exactly funny. what happened. I this really is what happened. Yeah. No, it is what happened. This is what the happened. Time. Well, I was like, I, I got you. I got you. Reading at the comedy store is like a sin or something to these people. They hate it. They it's, have to attack. It's so you. funny. No, but here, but what you're also book, extra uh, sensitive about a book where you don't want anyone to read the back of it. Because I don't want to think about Bruce's dumb voice reading the back of this book. I'm really interested in and like right. ruining. You're reading like, the back of it. Oh, me reading. Yeah, the back like of they'll it. see it and they'll start reading the back. It's like shut up. Like it's a pet peeve of her. She she doesn't she doesn't read the back of a I book. I don't read the back of the books. Spoilers. Yeah. I so read that, the last yeah. sentence. <laughs> that's, that's of the book? Yeah, it's not bad. I read the last sentence and then I start the book. Yeah, of the, you read the, read the last sentence of the book where yeah. it says like happily ever after. Yeah. And then, Hap- yeah. 
like I like to because I read fairy books. tales. <laughs> yeah, Jesus Christ. Anyway, I was reading across. Anyway, he calls me over. He goes, "Hey, is there a black word? Is there a racist word that someone can use to you as a black person?" This person was a person of color. This comic saying they this. were black. They were a person of color. Puerto Rican. Anyway, and they, they said they said white. they were not white, and they said that oh, the slurs used against me color. doesn't really hurt my feelings as much as certain ones do. Is this, is that it that way with you and black people? And I was just kind of saying, I said, no, immediately. I was like, they all suck. They're all pretty bad. Like, I don't have any range of it. I'm like, I hate all of them. Mm-hmm. But I'm trying to have an engaging conversation. I'm trying to be cool. So with I go on. With the want headliners that you want to impress. I want to You know what I'm saying? Sure, yeah. First shift. Saying. Felicia's yeah. like, this is but a moment. I know, right? <laughs> Let me really do something here. Let me put here. my bookmark in. Let me, <laughs> see, <laughs> let me try to have a real discussion. Anyway, so then I go, um, if someone called me like a spook, though, it would hurt. It, for some reason, in a way, like it wouldn't mean as much. Only because you're either like 75. I'm like, are you dead? Do you have dementia? Like, what's going on? Like, nobody under age of like 60 even yeah, says that. They don't know what that even is, right? So I was like, if someone my age calls me the N word, like you, Bruce, normally do, it really hurts me. <laughs> Abnormal. I he think, do it, I think it. I think <laughs> it. But you think it so loudly and you mouth the word. Yeah, you know? And you say and you're it like, you. And then you go, what? I'm not saying it. What? Yeah, yeah. But you're like, yeah. <laughs> exactly. It hurts more. It just hurts more yeah. when that happens every time, Bruce. So I just said that. And now at this time, another headliner had come in, parked behind me. And if I was doing my fucking job, maybe I would have turned away from this conversation. Oh, what a. But he, he's coming in and he gets out the car and this this comic just goes to him and goes, hey, spook. <gasps> The, guy, the comic gets out of the car and says it to you. No, the comic gets out the car. The comic who gets the car is black. And then the, the comic I'm talking to, the headline I'm talking to, just turns to him and goes, hey, spook. Now, these people have a long history. to get. Like, I've seen them here together. All the t- like, these yep. are, I know. Th- okay. So I was like, okay. Maybe y'all know each other. Like, this, they did not know each other like that for this Whoa. conversation yeah. to be happening. Was it Santino and Bobby? <laughs> so. <laughs> so. <laughs> so <laughs> You're two best friends. <laughs> all right. You can't call me that. You can't. You can't. <laughs> so then they both turn. He goes. He looks at me like, what did you tell me to say? I was like, I didn't tell you to say that. I said, it hurts less because you're probably he like, you he was like, yeah, yeah. he was like, why did you tell <laughs> me to say that to him? Threw, threw me under the bus. Under the bus. <laughs> uh, the, at the back of the bus, Right, too. the black stuff. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Threw you under the back of the bus. Right, no, right, first, the black <laughs> that, comic glad takes his that. phone out. Rosa, park your brain. Takes his, takes his, takes his the, phone the out. The black comic takes his phone brain. out, and he goes, park what do you say? To you. To, to everybody. He's like, what did you say? Hit what did you say in the phone? Sorry, am I interrupting? Is my racial story not No, god damn, I didn't know this story. I'm usually pretty tuned in with stuff here. I didn't hear about this. This is a really, it's a I'm 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 completely enthralled. No. He takes his phone out. That's all I'm saying. And he starts, starts recording. recording. Yeah. And he goes, what did you say? What did you say? And he puts it on me. And I'm like, wait, do you, is this a skit? Uh, do y'all know each other? Like, how well do you guys very really? very silly dudes. Dudes. Too. And I don't, I'm new. So then now I look crazy as like a black woman. He's like, you ain't got my back in the video. He's like, you don't have my back. What and there's say? no joking matter to any of this. No, he's. Kind of pissed. Right, which makes you think that you go, they're definitely joking. They're Can't definitely wait to find out who they're yeah. serious. <laughs> they have to be And joking. then they're, are they, are they not? And Bro. Go, oh, yeah. The first comic is so devastated. He's like, I'm so sorry. I wouldn't have said it. She said it wasn't that bad. I was like, I never said that. He I said wasn't he, listening Right. To you. He wasn't listening to me. I said they're all but bad. But why are you looking for one? Listen I to don't. One. Not you. So I'm saying the guy coming up. Why are you looking right. for like a new... What well, he was, do, he, I, I don't know. Yeah, just do a different. Felicia, thing. is there, there, a, buddy. Is there a way I could be racist and get away with it? But <laughs> <laughs> well, he said a lot of slurs about but his yeah, people, yeah. so I think he was just having a, a slur conversation. Asian. You know, though. He was slurring his so, words. <laughs> I'm trying here. So now, I swear to God, when they see me, I swear to God, he goes, Remember when you let <laughs> Blake call me, that, call me a spook? Every sing- and I was like, I didn't let nobody call you a spook. And now the comic who said it is always just like, remember you tried to ruin my career? <laughs> t- and I'm like, guys, I was reading in the parking lot on my first shift as a law person alone. And I just have not, now that's a thing that's they like to say. Honestly, it is really tough to read on this. Jo- you can read Yo, before yeah. you're clocked in, but yeah, like during the, 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 oh, the story, never, you shouldn't have been reading. No reading. Reading's yeah. bad for you. If you want to do comedy. No, that's it's not funny, true. The reading is the least important part of the story, but it does come back to you shouldn't have been reading. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's what Richie's gonna tell you back. Hey, hey. no book. It was an empty See what slot. literacy does. Yeah, <laughs> I don't want to see any books. <laughs> no reading, no yeah. writing. Yeah, it's so more. Same jokes yeah. every day. Oh, you, oh, you, the jokes you got now and riffing. <laughs> going to riff. Anybody wants to riff? Go ahead and riff. We're not no new material. No, I'm so. Uh, That's awesome. So if they say next awesome time story. they say. Uh, um, they said they're cool now. I think they're kind of joking. Just but call them both the N word. Yeah, I did. 
<laughs> I was like, y'all <laughs> niggas need to stop it. <laughs> Don't do this. <laughs> yeah, I got thrown under the bus. I just hard. That. I'm never talking That's so in the lot. No, it's so, it's such a funny lesson as a new guy. Like I've learned it with uh I put my foot in my mouth with like five or six mm. real paid regulars that I'm mm. pretty chill with now and one that like still I think where it, it's on and off again. That's okay. Because you did the same thing? Because I did a very similar thing. Yeah. What spook? Did you, do? you said spook? Uh, no, I was just scary. You know, did like you, it was Halloween season, and I went, ah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I took my hat and glasses you off. Were being and were spooky. Like, Somehow worse. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, horrible. That's yeah. crazy. Anyway, I have another shift this Wednesday. Very excited just to get back out there, <laughs> say more crazy things in the park. Well, well, yeah. I was just trying to make jokes. Like Jesselnik was like, "Hey, don't mess with the seat." And I was like, "I have to. Literally, I can't reach the pedals." Yeah. But I'll move it back. And then he was like, well, how tall are you? Which reminds me too of what, I, what Kelly said. Can I share that? When she was hosting. Do you remember that? She couldn't get the mic stand down. Oh, Kelly yes, Ryan, yes, yes, super yes, yes, funny yes. comedian. She couldn't Very get the funny. mic stand down and Jess Link was next. And she said, well, like everyone could see her not get it down. She said, this next comic is as funny as he is tall and brought him out. And he <laughs> said, nobody is that tall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But anyway, I just try to riff with them because... What did you or, say when he was like, "How tall are you?" You didn't finish that story. You just called it. He said. He said. <laughs> you just started yeah, a new then story. I called him the N-word. <laughs> <laughs> He'd be like, "You love my friend." Wild. He would love. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He'd be like, "That's yeah." You want to open for me? Or yeah. like, what? No, we just ripped back on. That girl is really cool. <laughs> <laughs> No, I yeah. just if I get if I don't know what to do, I just say, "Are the keys in the car?" And then I slowly walk away. Yeah, because I don't want to get involved with their. You want to know here the first time I met Justin Luke ever, and it's really funny to me, only because he he hurt my feelings so bad. <laughs> but it was, <laughs> but I, I, I realized he was joking. But I did. Re- it was a few years ago, and I did a set before him. I like did really well. I really crushed, and I don't even anyway. And I really crushed, and he came off the stage, and I came off the stage, and he was like, "Oh, good set," and I was like, "Oh, thank you," and I was like, "Holy shit," you know. And he went on stage. He was like, "Oh, give it up for your last." Comic. she's great huh and i was and they were like yeah woo and he was just like yeah if you like that shit anyway you're gonna love me <laughs> and i was like is he serious and i was like no what? wait what and i was like oh wait no he's joking yeah. sometimes he'll do that uh on stage he'll go uh give it up for whoever, whoever mark Mar- yeah. that was nothing check this out right, right. <laughs> he starts like that sometimes i think it's really funny it's so well, that's kind of same thing happened to me in the main room where i had a really good set and then like the host went up and then he went up right after and like same thing when I got off he was like good like good job and then I was like right, yeah what a oh, cool man thank you and then like <laughs> went out and like watched him come on stage and then he was like all right now that, that bullshit's over <laughs> <laughs> and, like, in, your head, in your head you know he's joking right. but still it, part of you heart. is like what the fuck oh, your heart yeah, is the part I yeah, yeah. oh I set. love that yeah. and I was like, was it really shit? Was I it- saw Bill Burr destroy someone because uh, just was so simply to and he was like walking out of the club and someone was like, a young comic was like, hey, Bill, can I get your autograph? And he went, no, fuck you. And kept walking and the kid went, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, he goes, I'm just kidding, man. man. Yeah, here's your autograph. Yeah. 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 Yeah, Bill's really <laughs> I don't nice. think he said fuck you. And he said like, no, what yeah, the fuck? Yeah, like, fuck yeah. 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 So and then and they came back and was like, I'm just kidding, man. Here's that again. And the feeling is still like, you're like, I suck, though. You're right. I shouldn't have asked. Yeah. So sorry. Well, you know, he's joking because yeah. it's real. Yeah, he's yeah. a little like, <laughs> That's on, really yeah. what he, it's real. Right. I went and saw Adam Sandler at Dynasty Typewriter a few years ago, right before he shot oh, that yeah, special. Oh, cool. yeah, And uh, he had two openers that were like younger dudes. And they did not do good. No, of course not. They did bad. All his friends are yeah, that's what I'm saying. just Adam Sandler's they, friends. They, <laughs> they did bad. And he literally came on stage, and of course, everybody like erupts, and then he gets quiet, and he goes, hey, how about the uh, two guys who uh, opened the show, huh? And everyone's like, yeah, he's like, yeah, you know, uh, one of them's uh, my nephew, the other one works for me, so... Yeah, I guess they deserve a shot. I don't know. <laughs> like, like they, they, they legitimately bombed. Yeah, like, yeah. In front of like sold out, everyone's like reeling because like the tickets were hard to get. Like yeah. everybody's like so excited, um, and like they bomb in front of a very eager audience. And then he's just like, yeah, they were. Yeah, anyway. And it, that, Do you think that that was the kind of crowd that anyone would have bombed, or they specifically? Bombed? No, you, because sometimes you go for open for a headline. Yeah, and everyone's excited to see them. Yeah, and they don't give it. They, don't, they don't understand that there's a show. But I guess some this of the is shows the were like that. Writer. For Polly Shore, I'm sure they're like, they're like, they're like we want to see Polly Shore. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, I can't believe he's not right here, right now. Yeah, right. I feel like it's easy at a theater. It can be if you're opening for somebody. That's where you could bomb your fucking ass off because people are still like getting drinks. People mm. are going to the bathroom. They're talking to their friend. We're like, 
if you're in like a place a, where everybody is sat down, like focused. Theater on, is nice though, because theater no, p- people who go to the theater know the show is starting. They're starting with like whatever. Yeah, but I mean, I've only done a theater like twice, opening for somebody, and it was chaotic. It was good, but you can just see, people are just walking to their sh- seats, and people are like, Ronnie. Ronnie, <laughs> hey Ronnie, we're, our seats are over here. Like people are yeah, like who legitimate. Who's the headliner? Uh, Theo Vaughn. Yeah, okay. So, <laughs> and all the, there we go. Everyone in Theo's crowd looks and talks exactly <laughs> like, like him. Yeah, like they, they, riff raff. Yeah, like the rapper. hundred yeah. percent. The and rapper like, riff raff. Yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then you go out to the thing, and they're like, "That was good, man." Hey, you think he's gonna come out? Hey, hey, you think he knows so many words? You, hey, <laughs> hey, you think he's gonna come out here? I'm like, I don't know, man. I'm trying I like to get how a, your eyes get. Yeah, I'm like, oh shit. That's literally how. That's a real country eye right there. Come on. No, they're like, I'm, I'm, okay. <laughs> that's, you know what's the worst? The country eye. No, the, the worst. Evil eye country eye. Yeah. You know what the worst eye anybody has is? Is I think about this like five like years ago. I had this brunch waitress. So you're going to say five times a day you think of that? I think of this all the time because you know whenever you get like the, there's a few of brunch them. Brunch waitress. <laughs> there's a few of them here that do this and they like will come up to the table and be like, so, uh, so like, okay, so we have the margarita and. Like well, they'll do this. this. Like one eye, is it just like drooped solid? No, it's just like, or is like, it moving? Go, like, uh, uh, so, like, you know, it's like, so but it's just like the, the dumb person eye, fast winking. Uh, I don't know. Oh, interest. Oh, like a, a blinky eye. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe have not. A, Maybe uh, re- restart the podcast. I don't not, look these yeah, vermin in the like face. Starting, I don't know. Uh, when vermin. <laughs> when someone annoy, when someone asks a really stupid question, like, uh, oh, is that a two drink maximum? I'll go, uh, uh, no, you just got to be cool. You know, and I'll yeah. just kind of keep the eyelid down for a second and be like, yep. You know what you got to do is you got to really... ju- you got to go back of the line and they'll go, what? And then you go, no, no, I'm just going. I like to laugh at them. I'm like, oh my God, what? Oh, a sarcastic. <laughs> did you say a Hang on. Wow, you go full for middle school bully. I like that. I just asked if we did two drink of Max. <laughs> we, uh, we got a joke. We got a guy who asked We got a potential guy who's going to headline yeah. and go on stage. To him, and maybe he's going to pop everybody. Hey, Felicia, are you in the lot right now? <laughs> <laughs> That, you you've got to go that far, have you? Yeah. You know that new sound <laughs> have you've been you? looking for? I haven't done any of this, but I'm going uh, to now we you meet this, this yeah. fucking line. This is really We're going to hold up the whole line. Yeah. Oh. Hey, everybody. <laughs> Did you? This guy has something to get say. This guy. Oh, this guy. Say it again. Say it again. <laughs> what? No, no. You, how you said it. How you said it. What did you say? What did you say? What did you say? Let's all say it on three. Two, three, maximum on three. <laughs> so bad. Yeah, it's really, I really hate the jokes. Um, from the people the line. <laughs> <laughs> no, like heckling. while like yeah. you're like that you're still talking yeah. and you say the word he- there's no heckling there's a two drink and then they go heckling and they interrupt you yeah. literally yeah. heckling yeah. they don't even realize that they're doing that they are actually heckling there they're just like yeah. no heckling <laughs> yeah. like, they don't realize that it's funny that they're the funnier <laughs> they're really is that they heckling. are heckling yeah, yeah. and I go ah there's the pr- there's gonna be a problem yeah. later. Yeah. Ah you've identified yourself yeah. haven't yeah. you sir? that's something everyone thinks they're a mystery but that is true like. I see a per- problem in the line, they're a problem in the room. You're going to say perfect oh, I, I call out people constantly. I'll see people, I'll go, and I'll go, hey, uh, everybody in the main room, there's five guys in uh, cargo shorts, flip-flops, <laughs> right. and polos, and they are fat, and they're going to be a problem. Be and a problem. It does I always come. like when they are the problem, and you tell the server to close them out, and they're like, oh, yeah, they, they were <laughs> yeah, 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 the server like, <laughs> you know, Why did you say I, I will start going, when they come in, I'll go to the server, I'll go, be ready. Yeah. To close them out. That yeah. Right there. yeah. And the server's like, come on, I need that $9. <laughs> yeah. Let me like, ruin the show like for the sake of $9. Yeah. yeah, they're always our bad tippers. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I might have told this last week, but I, like, a, yeah, I did definitely tell. Never mind. There was a group of dudes that were like older than me that like I just took command of. felt very good that yeah. they were like dad, like very much like dad age. And I just went, no. Like, not my dad. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Or not my dad. Right, yeah. exactly. I was like, guys. Stop. Yeah. And, the, and they're like, oh, okay, yeah. sorry, yeah. <laughs> I'll double down. Whenever I see the group of, especially if I see the group of, like, eight, I'll always walk them to the table, and then even though they've been spieled in the lobby, I'll be like, guys, before I leave, <laughs> <laughs> I, no, nobody <laughs> likes fun more than me. All right? I want everyone to have a good, hey, you want to high-five your buddy? High-five yeah. your buddy. But, you know, table talk, this, don't use your phone. There's Because in the line when there's eight of them, they're like, you're doing the thing, and they're going to be, they're not listening, they're sack-tapping their friend and being like, dude, J- the Johnny's sword. gay! Uh, and like, yeah. just, that's their entire... Yeah. Well, you, 
it's even worse when it's like one guy. I feel like though, you saw me. I had to throw that guy down. That was great. I thought you said. I thought you said. Oh, I thought you should get oh, thrown yeah. down. <laughs> I, I, was, I pushed. I almost pushed him down the stairs because he was really like coming up on my chest. I was like, bro, I got a bigger chest than you, bro. <laughs> yeah. What do you think we're gonna she do? She really right got now? at it. I, I remember you had, going. You, had, you security called security straight. and but you were like still there going. I told you like I saw it from way down I the hallway. I told you like three times, man. Yeah. That was that's what I overheard. I was like, good for you. And Marvin kicked that motherfucker. Yeah, Marvin kicked him out. Yeah, bro, you gotta go, bro. But. Can I say the special guest who was in the room? And yeah, like, it's David Spade. It's right. I don't know. If, I don't know. I'm just yes. asking. Just yes, asking the captain. Hey, thank you for asking. Jeez. Yes, of course you can. Um, but captain's approval. I had already said something to him, and then he literally said David's punchline as he said, like, uh, and then David had to go, like, okay, thank you for fucking that up. And the person, the two people in front of him, turned around. I was like, all right, all right, like, way to go, asshole. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh Wait, no. So that person. was the first warning. No, my first warning. He was laughing really loud. Now I know that sounds. He it's was not too enthusiastic. Yeah, yeah it was yeah. a laugh like wrong parts and very loud, like very like like if she just started like, ah! like yeah. crazy. You yeah. can get kicked out. Oh, so we're saying you like, are I disrupting the show. Yeah, right. you're gone. I have right. a story after this. Right. About just, that. Like, yeah, yeah. Remember, the best is never somebody's it. like screaming and they're calling the headliner <laughs> names and then you like right. take kick them out. They're like, what right. I do? I was yeah. just right. laughing. I'm helping and laughing. Literally, I went up to him and he goes like, so what? I can't laugh anymore. And I was like. You can laugh. You just need to bring it down. You're the loudest one. You're and like, you bring it no, down. You know you what I mean? Cannot laugh. Sometimes anymore. I do tell people, I go, no, don't laugh. Yeah. Wellington. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Sorry, no, we've gotten into fights before I about that. It's so funny. We haven't, but I, I, I talked to her. She, yeah. She's not happy. Yeah, she does laugh the way she laughs. Yeah. All right, yeah. <laughs> just love you, babe. <laughs> love you. That's. We're gonna no. find out that that's in the that it's been a secret this whole time that Luke's wife is actually Wellington. <laughs> that's what she's talking about yeah. all this like sex. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And I'm crazy. just like walking around like yeah. whistling. Like, yeah. the <laughs> your, your actual wife is like a friend of yours that's like doing you a favor to cover up those Wellington This stuff. is my beard, but I'm still straight. <laughs> <laughs> that's really funny. Oh, no, man. but he just thought I was trying to press him. He was just like, I feel disrespect. I feel like she didn't have no respect for me. And she I was like, I think you? you're sexist and you think I'm trying to check you, bro. Here's the thing. No, yeah. the thing is, why you would can... I have respect for you if you disrespected yeah. all my shit? Right. The <laughs> funniest part about Ryan's email this week for the schedule was all the things he normally says, and he says, Treat talk people. to customers the, the way you would like to be talked to. to. Yeah. And I think yeah. he's seen a lot, he's seen us a little too flying off the handle. And also I... he flies off the handle. Right. Yeah, dude, yeah. the other night he was flying off the handle at a promoter. <laughs> 100%. He was like, this is my club. 100%. Your club. That's awesome. Because even later in the parking lot, he he was and it's like I don't I love I love Ryan. I'm glad. He was yeah, yeah. arguing with this person, even like what they're doing didn't annoy me that much. But he has other stuff to be annoyed about, so that annoyed him more. Yeah. And that's fine; it's all very fine. I, this, We're all I working on I, ourselves. I don't yeah. give a shit about this person yeah. that he's talking to. Yeah, uh, fuck that person. Ryan's then, the best when they're <laughs> when they're like drunk ladies because you, they're like, "I went to manager," and you go get them, and they're like, Ooh, "Yeah, I didn't know this was the oh, manager." Yeah, 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 yeah. Anytime you talk to a it's woman, funny. just send Ryan out there, and he's yeah, like, yeah. "How can I help?" You? I always just they start yelling at me. I'm like, "No, no, no." Let me go get the manager. <laughs> oh my you see, God. My, Man. my issue is, is especially yeah. if it's a guy, if they start yelling at me, my first thought isn't, hey, go get the manager. And I've said this multiple times. My first thought is telling them, I know you're, I tell them something along the lines of, you're not about to talk to me the way you think you're about to talk yeah, to yeah, me. Yeah. And then I'll be like, so you can sit, this is the guy, I walked in. The, <laughs> that was, is very threatening. I wasn't, even, I wasn't even working in, in the room, I don't think. I was walking down the hall and I saw Saul and he goes, man, call security. Like, call security. <laughs> call security. And I was like, what's going on? If you on? close your eyes, Saul is uh, Cat Williams. Yeah. 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 And he was like, call security. And I, in my head, I'm like, what's going on? It's probably something, we can figure this out, whatever. And then I, he's, I was Saul like, gets mad in the room. Yeah, I was gets like, yeah. I mean, Saul gets mad like a dad though, where he's like, there's not a lot of rage. There's just like, I don't give a fuck no more. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, do whatever yeah, the fuck. Like, Y'all disappoint, you know yeah. yeah. disappoint me. Yeah. That and then, so this guy was like, <laughs> this guy was mad because he, I, I don't remember if I told this on the podcast or not already, but this guy was mad because he got terrible service as you do and he uh, you know his, ser his server he couldn't find his server and then his server was ignoring him on purpose and i was watching it and he was like he was like the, he was like i said i look for my fucking server and i literally i mean i was like come out into the hallway here and i remember it was very funny because it was in front of uh omid singh yeah. alex hooper That's and so lara bites and Great. they were all so standing in the hallway talking and i like brought this guy out here i was like what's going on and he's like fucking yelling and like and i like getting he's like yelling i mean i'm like i literally told him i was like hey man like 
because he started being like three fucking times, and I literally I was like, I was like, first things first, we all need to chill out. And I was like, second thing, same thing, you're not about to talk to me in this way. And then he's like, would like, because he would like step towards me, and I was like, so you're gonna back the fuck up. I was like, you're gonna stand right here. You're gonna shut your mouth, and I'm gonna go get your fucking. I was like, I'm gonna go get your card for you, and then. Well, before that, his wife had started yelling at me, and then he started yelling at me, and I was like, guys, who's the only one helping you in this situation? I was like, I got nothing to do with it. And I got nothing to lose. No, I'm, like, I'm like, I, I got, got nothing, nothing to do with my it. Own time. I got nothing to do with it, and I'm the only one helping you. Yeah. So then he starts pushing on me, and I'm like, look, man. Bro. And I'll, that, and then I'll tell people, hey, I'm being very calm, and you're, if you, you know, I'm... There's, I'm not gonna be the one throwing you out. There's security that's gonna be yeah. throwing you out. And I tell them, like, they're a lot scarier than me. I'm not a scary guy, but security would love to drag you out of here. Yeah, by our your security hair. is not a fucking joke. No. no. Like, you can get beat, the fu- you yeah, get they, beat up, dude. They will like, you like, get fucked up. Where the Sunset Strip still? People yeah. are like, this is a comedy store and rock and roll anymore because of like, whatever. Yeah, wait until like, someone gets oh, thrown down the fucking stairs, yeah, dude. For why don't you try to come at me? I'm weak as fuck. I know I have a lot of friends. Security. Oh, yeah. Well, that's what I tell them, and I'll tell, like, people will, like, start chipping with me, and I'll be like, hey, man. If you, I, you, th- you think I'm that, the, you think I I'm told the that guy, I was one. like, dude, if you, I was like, if you don't calm down, you're going to get drug out of here. Yeah. And he was like, oh, and I was like, I'm telling you, dude, well, I'm, chill I'm, the fuck out. And wow. then it was mainly, I went back and I was like talking to the three who it's people who don't work here, like do spots here, but like, aren't really around all the time. Mm. And they were like, that was crazy. And yeah. I was like, oh, I know that guy's nuts. He's like, yeah, he was nuts. But I also can't believe you guys are just allowed to talk to people like that. And I was like, well, he was in there. They were like, oh, totally. Like, yeah, he was yeah. well, coming from, in the wrong. Like, yeah, your friend's yeah. perspective, though. Yeah, but if like, they yeah. saw, like, a, in a, like some retail guy yeah. right. talking oh, to a customer. At, at Target, and the yeah. guy was basically like, hey, if you don't chill out, someone's going to drag you out of here by yeah. your ears. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You said by your ears. Yeah. I say by, by, by your ears all the time here, dude. That's hilarious. My favorite out thing Out the is... door, through the window. Yeah. Your choice, yeah. partner. I can't talk to people like that because I know it will escalate. Like, if I'm on stage and there's one person rowdy, I can because the audience will laugh at how ridiculous it is. But one-on-one, they just get more and more mad. They really do. So I, like, leave. Like, what? this was what happened. There were guests of Emily. I think I can say that. But, sure. but because of that, we Your wanted to show them. Who knows which Emily? Yeah, we wanted to show them Emily. a really good time. And <laughs> yeah. we put them on the benches. There were three of them. We gave them two tables so they had plenty of room. Yeah. We, like, took good care of them. And everything was cool. And then there was, or I think it was that same night, and they had that same mentality where they were like, it was just one lady and she was helping, you know, mm-hmm. like yes. after every single thing. And it was a really small main room too. The sides were down. It yeah. wasn't full. And after everything, she's like, So distracting. Woo! Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's you like, know oh. it. <laughs> and, then it was, and then, like, the comments were like, "Sock yeah. you in the head." Right. And it was, it was like three comics <laughs> in, the ear, bitch. and I knew we had to Drink do something about it. And I told the other door guys, and it was one of those things where I was kind of hoping someone else would do it, but since I yeah, spotted oh it, I know God. it's my responsibility. Yeah, so I went, and I had a couple of problems with customers that week, so I immediately just went to management first. Cause yeah, really so I told the manager, HR department. I told manager, hey, this is what's going on. They're guests, and they say, yeah, you you got to just tell them. And and other door guys had heard it too, yeah. so it wasn't just me. So they said, yeah, you just got to go tell them to be quiet. So I go up there, and I go, I, hey, everybody's everybody's cool, uh, but you just gotta you just gotta. Keep, <laughs> I, oh no, I go every everything's fine, but uh, I was told to tell you to just keep it down a little bit, and she goes. What? Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> she's like, <laughs> she's like, oh, we can't, so fun- we can't laugh. Crazy. And I was like, no, laughing's great. Laughing's great. Right, I can't laugh. That uh, fucking question. But no, I was like, yeah, you sorry. cannot. I was like, the yelling out after yeah. every word. Just tell them no. no we no, just no. can't do that. And she yeah. goes, our policy is no, no laughing. laughing. Yeah. So. <laughs> That's our boss. <laughs> Next time I will. But then at the comedy store. I can't laugh. No. no. She starts blowing up and then I go, You just that can't yelling. And she goes, Yelling? Correct. I wasn't yelling. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. Oh and then I just uh, she's I, yelling. Yes. Right and I literally just start walking away and I hook You're like back. I go back to Joe. Uh, well, what do what do they think is happening? I don't know. I don't know. What so, do they think is happening? I don't know. So I tiptoe back out of the room and then I go back to management where I Came from, and I go okay. I let him know, and it is bad. And, <laughs> and so we we zoom in on the on the security footage oh of God. where they're sitting, and they're just like, 
Oh my goodness. <laughs> and they're like, the Ugh. three of them are just freaking out. So Joe, I go, Joe, I think you got to go in there, man. <laughs> he, which is our new manager. He's awesome. Yeah. And so he goes in there. Joey and Knuckles. Meanwhile, <laughs> I, I, stay, I, I stay back because I know if she sees me, like she's going to freak. So th- this whole time I'm in the office watching it on the cameras with Ryan, Ryan Sam, and Hormos. And we're having. Or we should be somewhere yeah. else, but yeah, yeah. So he's, he's, he's in the main room. Yeah. He's smoking <laughs> a joint in the office, yeah. and he's like, and then they're like, Luke, you sh- you should have done something else. And Hormos is like smoking in the office. We're watching Joe talk to her in the lobby, <laughs> and the whole time it's just a lot of arm stuff. And we're like, we're making jokes. Like we're doing their lines now. Like <laughs> yeah, we're yeah, like, yeah, yeah. like, like, listen, I can't take your number. I'm married. Like, we're doing <laughs> I jokes. want a number this big. <laughs> <They're Yeah. making> <laughs> but it goes on forever. And Joe comes back and says how he's telling them like it's just a slight adjustment. Like nobody's in trouble. Just we just yeah. have to keep it down. And, and comes out, she says the words, "I'm helping." And he's like, no. And she says, she's an entertainer. She says, she owns NBC. So then, oh, yeah. <laughs> so then I'm like, well, there goes my career. But then Horbos is saying, it... we should go back and tell him that that girl who told you to be quiet is fired. And <laughs> but anyway, it, it goes on and she's, on and on. She, she runs NBC or she's the head? She said she owns NBC. She owns NBC. Yeah. They, and Peacock. <laughs> yeah. They get it in their head. It's like, man, we know you run Peacock. Uh-huh. This ain't NBC. And also, like, like you don't run Peacock. Yeah. You don't, you don't I don't own. know what you they run. Billionaire. You know what you right? gotta hit them with? You gotta hit people like that when they're doing that. You gotta go over and you gotta very calm. You gotta be like, "Hey guys, I want everyone to have fun, <laughs> but right now you're at like an eight, nine. I need you at like a four or five. They, they would have killed you. Oh, this lady would have like but cut then your I, throat. You know, I go out there. I, she no, I crack my knuckles. She snapped. So yeah. then, so then, I love we're, it. Joe's I love now, the conflict so much. Joe's now filling me in on what's going on, and we're still Joe watching in the lobby. And she's still yelling at Matt now, who's working cover. So oh she's just God. yelling at Matt. Anyway, <laughs> Matt, they go out. Matt's funny when he gets yelled at. Because yeah. 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 Matt's just yeah. sitting there like this. I, okay. Maybe you okay. shouldn't have been talking. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know. I don't have any power here. Yeah. That's him. Versus Lockwood is pretty Lockwood good. Lockwood on yeah. his yeah, yeah, stool yeah. behind the thing. Yeah. It's like, I don't, okay, okay, bro. <laughs> okay, bro. Okay. If you're going to toss at me like that? Yeah. No, I'm not gonna help you. The best part no! is, I'm not gonna help you. They, <laughs> three of them leave. She slams. Lenny comes down. Who I love. Lenny's a server here, and they go, "Did you rat on me to Lenny?" And she's like, rat. "She's like, what are you talking about?" Like, she I don't no play idea. that shit. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> the <laughs> least rat yeah. in the yeah. kitchen. She thinks, I'm from the Bronx. She's like, "Well, if you did it, then he ratted. Somebody ratted on me because I said I was." I anyway, they leave. They're outside. We're still watching them on the footage. They're like, they're talking to other customers. Like they're, they're just <laughs> right. making the scene. You see them try to like. They get the, you can see them like build up the curve. Up. See the revenge in their eyes. Oh. Oh. They stomp back and the door's locked now. So they can't get in. That's really funny. So they go They're in. trying to grab the square. Yeah. 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 That's the funniest. Yeah. Like, wait, wait, we're like we're I dying. Like when people go. Finger, like your fingertips are fucking Alex Holland <laughs> yeah. free solo string. Right, right, right. You're gonna they pull the in. door open. Matt's oh, in God. the lobby, like I'm not letting them in. They come in through the front patio, and this is the best part is, it was like the comedy store had, (laughs) the building has like a spirit to it. This lady, like, it's like the ground like pulled her pants because she like, she tripped on her way in. And I swear to God, it was like the building, like, fuck you. (laughs) Yeah, right. (laughs) And she was like, never mind. Once you trip, it sobered her up. She was like, well, I look stupid now. No, there was no, there was no self-awareness or accountability. But then they, as soon yeah. as they left, I just was like, okay, I'll go back to work now. Oh, my God. Okay. I, I, I hate those kind of people. But I also hate when – I love when people try to open a very clearly closed door. Yeah. Push it. It's hilarious. I understand the push because right. it looks like a push door. But when they want to fight. Trying to, pr- <laughs> right. trying to pry it open. I remember the first like, time I tried why, to do why it. Why would you go through this door? <laughs> It's clearly closed. I remember the first one of my first days here, I tried to open that door, and I was like, this is dumb. This is – I've learned – Never to do this again. I went through it, and I thought I could just turn around and open it. A lot of like, oh, open yes. mic comics were entering through the main room lobby that night too, which I thought was really weird. It drives me nuts. I tell him to go. I tell him to go around. I told a comic who was like, he came through the line, he waited through the line. I was like, you have tickets? Sold out main room. He's I'm like, a comic. he goes, no man, I'm a comic. And I was like, oh, uh, we're doing tickets right now. If we have room, just come in the back later. Give it a minute. And he was like, what the fuck are you talking about? What? And I was like, excuse me. And I just went. Wrong energy, bro. They're yeah, like, I'm really I like just, that. I'm trying to get everybody. In. And he was like, 
All right. And he like didn't tr- he like kind of trust. He was like, yeah, All I ain't right. got that patience no more. And, well, I said, and so and I go to the improv, yeah. buddy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, Think you mean the, the Laugh Factory? Go to the, uh, go to, yeah, yeah. yeah. Flappers love, West. Go, down yeah, go to the Laugh Factory, tell me you're a comic, you'll yeah, yeah. breathe that, yeah, right see, in. Yeah, see how they treat you there. Yeah. 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 I, I told you, don't go in with the ticketed customers. Right, Wait right. five minutes and go around the back, dumbass. You look Jesus. cooler anyway, and people just know you're a comic. Like, don't you want to know... Don't you want other people to know you're a comic? Like, if you blend in with everybody else. Also, you can't just say you're a comic anymore. I I, yeah. I need to know where you're from. Yeah, I'm getting tired of these people. I, I'm going to be I, honest. I go, I, when people are like, oh, I'm a co-, I go, where are you from? What's yeah, the, yeah. What do you do? Yeah, you need to find out people's management and reps, and then you say, yeah. well, no, no, tell no, them like, uh, we'll no. contact your people yeah. to make sure that you could come no, in. No, your manager came the other night. It was Big Fly and flexing on me. Big and yeah, flexing and on you nobody. Were, yes, he was. What did he say? He came up, and he was like, oh, I That you just called me right now, and that's why I was like, I know Anybody else in the bitch. Anybody you else in the world, I would be like, are his little Felicia. bitch. I'm not nobody's bitch. I, I am. You I wouldn't even go with your shit. He's the only one who ever believed in me. <laughs> oh my God. What, what did he do? He literally came up to me. I'm in the back. He comes up to me. He goes, uh, can I just watch in the back of the I'm OR? And I Bruce's go, Bruce's manager. Hey, right, okay. And he goes, I'm looking. And I was like, oh, no, we're a little full right now. And this is when Ryan was like, really yeah, upset yeah. about you're it. You're back to guy, yeah. Yeah, and I was like, oh, we're a little full right now. He was like, well, I'm at Bruce. Can you get Bruce? And I was like, I can't get nobody. I'm not getting Bruce. Yeah, you right. know what But I mean? also, like, you're at the back door. Like, say you're Bruce's manager right. or something. So then he yeah. was like, and then he was like, I'm his manager. And I was like, oh, you're his manager. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, Felicia came and got me. She's like, hey, Bruce, you're, you're literally. Man- hey, you're like, manager. he's like from here to the door. And she goes, hey, Bruce, your manager <laughs> is here. <laughs> Because like that's what is, really funny. But he also doesn't yeah. look like a manager. He's nah. a fucking he looks like a dude. bro. Yeah, he's, he's like a good dude. looking like former D one athlete. Like, like, a regular like, dude. Look like that a, looks like a man. That's what a manager. He doesn't looks like. look like if he was like you know if he looks more like Alex. A good manager. Most managers look like Alex Hanna. <laughs> I feel like, like most of them are like if they're young, they're all, they all are like Alex Hanna size and they're like oh hello I'm the what believe, he's like believe it or not hey, Bruce, what's up? but my manager is a woman. Yeah. Oh shit! How'd you get one of those? Yeah. So it looks like Alex Hanna. Yeah. No. <laughs> oh my God. Shut up, dude. <laughs> you and that guy have a real relationship, though. That's really into- You guys stood in the hallway real close. I was you like, should. I gotta tell Cal what is going on. Conversation. Yeah, yeah. He yeah. just called me right now because he said that he's probably yeah. gonna be able to get me some fucking Alan Jackson I'm tickets. He's a good oh, guy. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> I'm telling that's Kelly. Cool. That's like some white guy hugging shit. Oh, Thank you. Yeah. yeah, that's bro. That's bros. We're in there. Well, we're in there. That's we're okay. talking. Talking business, and he goes, "Who's that person at the back door?" And I was like, "I've never met her." And that's when he, you said the end. <laughs> yeah, right? That's, that's, right. that's <laughs> when he, he, like, he, he got out of the car, and, and he was like, "Remember when you told me I could say that word?" I remember. <laughs> well, this has yeah. been a really good episode. Uh, every Wednesday or so, you can you can come see us. If <laughs> oh, Richie, we're ending, I thought if, the fighting if, was if, just started. If Richie hasn't <laughs> shut the show down on Wednesdays, no, we have like four in the works, right? Coming up. We have what? We have like four shows on Wednesday. Hey, we better. Like two and There's then a new a, guy, a real cool guy two. that's going to be doing shows. Who's calling you now? Time. No one's calling me. I'm checking the time. We got, oh, yeah. We have plenty of time. Um, <clears throat> Felicia, He's where done. can people He's find done. you He's online done. and everywhere? Everywhere, same <laughs> handle, fell for tall. Cool. Yeah. Wait, say it again. I talked over. I'm sorry. No, it's fine. That's exactly how I want but to But I want to follow you. Fell for tall on everywhere. F E L. F A T A L E. You got to be a bit of a reader. One L and one L. Yeah. Like uh-huh. femme fatal. Yeah, you know, you know. But I know that like from confusing film. Confusing as hell. <laughs> film fatal. Film. Bruce Gray, where can people find all your podcasts and people find you yelling more and more every day? <laughs> right. You're so red right now, bro. Just like, my manager! I love him! I would do anything for him, dude. I would kill for him. You'd get him me too. Would he you knows. get him Alan Jackson tickets? I would give him my fucking life. Dick. Uh, what? If I had to. A kidney? <laughs> I would give him my kidney if he promised right. success. Well, what's his name and where can we? Find him. Uh, Bruce Gray Comedy.com for all information and show dates. Okay. And uh, donate to Alex Hooper's GoFundMe. I did. Yeah. yeah. Well, I didn't. Yeah. Uh, shout out Alex Hooper's. Uh, Alex Hooper is a very funny comedian who has uh, cancer and he's going through chemo and he has a GoFundMe. Uh, America's please, got talent. Yeah. I mean, comedy. It doesn't. It just, he's a good. And it, just throw, if you can throw a few bucks, every little bit for him helps and he deserves a little bit of our support because uh, our country is broken and, if and the you healthcare can't, system if you is a joke uh, and it's embarrassing to door. be an American. It really uh, is. Jesse, where, or no, Bruce, where, what about all your f- bag fries? It's and, all there. Yeah, okay. Comedy.com, power, Je- powered by Squarespace. Jeffrey, Jetski, Jeffrey. Juicy. Jeffrey is my Jesse favorite Jesse Smollett. I have an exciting <laughs> announcement. I'm headlining my first club yeah. ever. I've headlined before in bars and 
you know, but you took Guam on the road. I took Guam on the road to San Diego. We, <laughs> we played different bars, but uh, oh, that's really funny. It was, the, San Diego. It, it was the same night, different shows. Yeah, we had to. So, so oh. I thought it was the same show, and I really wish that was the bill. I would have loved to take him, but he was yeah. at the Laugh Factory, and I was at Good Bar. Yeah, and you're on Guam's. Now here's the thing tour. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What's really weird? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, when are you headlining, and where are you headlining? So I'm headlining Thursday, October 13th, the Ontario Improv. Yeah. yeah. So, please Everybody. come out. I'm only going to cool. make fifty dollars unless I sell a hundred and fifty tickets. <laughs> so well, who's producing this, Vargas Mason? <laughs> I don't know if I should tell the deal memo. Uh, I, that's not classy, but um, I really need classy. you to come what, out. Uh, We're in the what, what, what night of the week is that? Thursday, the thirteenth. Yes, Thursday the thirteenth in October. Perfect. Is Guam opening for you on that one? Or? You know, I would. They won't let me Guam's pick closing. my openers yet. Guam's closing yeah. for five. Um, okay. If it goes well, I can bring Guam go, go to the next one. When step. Gerard filmed his special here, he had Jamar go up at the end for five minutes. I love really that. Because he couldn't, because <laughs> they didn't want him to open. <laughs> but he also had Argus Hamilton open for his Did special. He? Yeah, that's that great. was his opening. Right. Um, I love Argus. And that's where everyone can find you? And at Jetsky Johnson. Sure. Yeah. He's okay. like, this next guy, Jamar Carmichael. <laughs> 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 Buddy, just go out there and have fun. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Great stuff. Who's proud. this young man who's <laughs> with the cameras? That's Spike Lee. Well, good to meet <laughs> you, son. <laughs> yeah. Keep at it. Yeah. 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 You're getting love. This <laughs> camera. He'll, he'll not see your set and go, that was great. Good job. You, you, you not you, they got shut right up. Been knocked and you them dead. knocked yeah. them right. Hey, I'm an impressionist. Him. You're pretty good. I'm He's really good at really local good. Uh, impressions. I'm at Luke Does Stuff on hey, Twitter. Up? Verified with less than 2,000 <laughs> followers. And uh, at help, 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 help on Instagram. It's a really good episode. Thanks, everybody, for being on. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.